Hello everyone and welcome to our video series on Learn German for Beginners. In this video you will be able to test your knowledge of German at the end of level A1. There will be multiple choice questions. You have to select the correct answer. The correct answer will be displayed in 15 seconds. And here's the first one. Guten Tag. Ich. Mm -hmm. Alex. And the answer is Guten Tag. Ich heiße Alex. Make sure to conjugate the verb correctly. Nummer 2. Hallo, wie geht es dir? And what would be the correct reaction to this question? That would be gut und dir. Option B would be wrong since the question is informal. Here's the third one. Welche Sprachen du? Here again the verb has to be conjugated correctly and your answer is Welche Sprachen sprichst du? Here's the fourth one. Das ist eine Tasche. Mm -hmm. Tasche kostet 10 Euro. You have to fill in the blank with the correct article. And the answer is Das ist eine Tasche. Die Tasche kostet 10 Euro. The next one. Die Lampe ist nicht billig. Sie ist hm hm. The opposite for the adjective billig is teuer. Die Lampe ist nicht billig. Sie ist teuer. Are you enjoying our video and the content? Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and enjoy more videos. Let's look at the next one. Guten Tag. Ich brauche <laughs> Couch für mein Wohnzimmer. Since the article for Couch is the, hence you would use the indefinite article eine. Guten Tag. Ich brauche eine Couch für mein Wohnzimmer. Here's the seventh one. In Hamburg, hm <laughs> hm, viele Sehenswürdigkeiten. You have to fill in the correct verb. And the correct answer is, in Hamburg, Gibt es viele Sehenswürdigkeiten? The next one. Axel. Wann fängt der Unterricht an? Sabine. Hm <laughs> hm, 19 Uhr. You have to fill in the blank with the correct preposition. When talking about time or Uhrzeit, you use the preposition um, um 19 Uhr. Here's the ninth one. Am Wochenende. Hm, 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 hm. And the answer is, am Wochenende kaufen wir ein. Einkaufen is a separable verb. Ein trennbares Verb. Hence the verb will be conjugated and in the second place, whereas the prefix will be placed at the end. 
Here's the ninth one. Verkäufer. Guten Tag. Was möchten Sie? What would be the correct reaction of the customer? Here, please look at the situation. The seller is greeting and then asking what one needs. So the reply should give information on what the buyer needs. In this case, D. Ich hätte gern zwei Kilo Birnen. Here's the next one. Das kann Max gut. And the answer to this one is Max kann gut Englisch sprechen. The modal verb takes the second position, whereas the other verb is placed at the end in infinitive. Let's look at the next one. Weißt du? Mhm. <laughs> Kommt Frau Schmidt? This is a simple one, as you have to just select which question word completes the question. And the answer is, weißt du, woher kommt Frau Schmidt? Number 13. Herr Müller geht zur Bank. Er muss ein Konto. Hm, hm, hm. And the answer is, Herr Müller geht zur Bank. Er muss ein Konto eröffnen. Here's the next one. Ich habe morgen einen hm <laughs> hm beim Zahnarzt. And the answer would be Ich habe morgen einen Termin beim Zahnarzt. Nummer 15. Ich bin krank. Hm <laughs> hm tut der Kopf weh. And here your answer should be C. Ich bin krank. Mir tut der Kopf weh. Do you know why the answer should be mir and not ich, mich or es? Do write it in the comments and let the others know. Hier ist der nächste Satz. Saskia fährt mit hm hm Fahrrad zum Büro. Which article is correct? And the answer is Saskia fährt mit dem Fahrrad zum Büro. Mit is a daily preposition. So, das Fahrrad Changes to dem Fahrrad. Number 17. <laughs> Man hier rauchen. You have to conjugate the verb correctly. And the answer is, darf man hier rauchen? With the pronoun man. The verb has to be conjugated in the third person singular. The next one is Am Wochenende <laughs> ich ins Kino gegangen. Here's the answer. Am Wochenende bin ich ins Kino gegangen. The helping verb with gehen in Partizip Perfect is sein and correctly conjugated here, bin. Nummer 19. Wie findest du hm hm Pullover? And the answer is Wie findest du diesen Pullover? 
der Pullover in Akkusativ ist den Pullover. Hence, diesen Pullover. Du is the nominative subject. And now the last one. Ich verstehe diese Übung nicht. Hm, hm, ich möchte versuchen. All these conjunctions stand at position zero. But the correct answer is Ich verstehe diese Übung nicht. Aber ich möchte versuchen. So, how many did you get correct? Do let us know in the comments. For this video, there won't be any podcast. However, you can access the transcript and a worksheet with more questions on Patreon or as our YouTube channel member. Danke. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked this video, do give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you still haven't. You can click on the bell to receive notifications whenever we upload a new video. If you have any comments or questions, you can leave them in the comment section below. Tschüss! Auf Wiedersehen!